wait, you guys know each other? Yeah. I feel like we're lacking a lot of context. So, um, could you, like, <laughs> explain? Oh, me and Coralia met her in the Kingdom of Stars. Right, um, we eventually became friends, but we never really spoke until... now. And now you're trying to destroy the Pillar of Phantoms? Yes, we're gonna stop your delusions. Wow, Tempest. So you've really gotten braver. Hmm, well, why don't you tell your brand new friends about all that you've done? Uh, Tempest, what is she talking about? You fully manipulated me, and besides, I've changed. Well, in that case, why did you lure these fairies right into our trap? Yo! Ugh! Oh, what happened? Oh, I have a really good joke that I could use as a response. <sighs> it better be a knee slapper. Go on. They blew us out of the water. But I'm... You know what? I feel like comedy really isn't your thing. Uh, yeah. Anyways, um, I don't get why they teleported us out of tides when we can literally just go back. <sighs> um... Tough? Yeah, I don't think it's working. You think? Right, so now what? Well, now I'm highly doubting the fact that the Pillar of Phantoms is what's causing the delusions. It must be something or someone else. Huh, Naboo was also there when I got my powers, so maybe it has something to do with the clan? Well, then we're gonna have to go to their headquarters. And we're also gonna have to talk to Mrs. Farragonda more in depth about this. Ugh, I thought that this was just gonna be a small mission when we're gonna go and abolish a stupid decree, a power hunt decree. And then we're gonna have sushi. I didn't know that it would be like such a long thing. Well, since we got ourselves involved, we have to go with the mission all the way through. Then let's go. Right. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, yes, that's all that happened so far. It's a lot to take in and to digest, but whatever. Roxy, you're coming with us. Transform right now. Quick. Finally, a mission I can go on. <sighs> Let's do this. Let's go to the headquarters. Right, stop the delusions. Where's Naboo and where is Valtor? Kissing? I don't know. How are we supposed to know? He doesn't tell us anything. He just, I don't know, just makes us grab him coffee or whatever. So you're basically his servants? You know what? I've really been trying to deny that, but yeah, we are. <laughs> Ew, pathetic, gross. Anyways, where is he? 
uh, Flora, they just said they don't know. They must know. They're just lying. Now you're just pointing fingers randomly. A little bit hurtful, but I get where you're coming from. Are you seriously having a full-on conversation? Well, um, I mean, well, yeah. <laughs> I'm back. Huh? But we destroyed you, like, a year ago. What? What's going on? I'm so confused. This is stupid. Right, well, either way, I'm back. It's a delusion! Ugh. Ugh. Hurtful words, Bloom. I just managed to find a tear in space and time and managed to get out of whatever prison you sent me to. Hmm. Whichever one of you cast the delusion upon Tides needs to stop right now. <gasps> oh, yeah, Tides. I have to speak to Coralia. See you. What, what, what? How can so much happen in the span of just one minute? We have to go back to Tides. Not before we find out whether or not the clan is casting the delusions. Welcome back, Audrey. The Winx bought your bait perfectly. They fell right into the trap, but then got away. They genuinely thought that the pillar of phantoms was the thing that was causing the delusions, though in reality it was really you. When I revealed myself back at the clan's headquarters, they thought I was a delusion. Could you imagine? How hurtful. <laughs> How hurtful. Oh uh, yeah, whatever. Hello there. You have got to be kidding me. Well, it's very over for the three of you. What did you do? We managed to speak to the military of Tides. Since Naboo said that the clan weren't the ones behind the delusions, well, we figured that it must be the sirens, obviously. But when we actually started dissecting everything, we realized that it couldn't possibly be the sirens. They were too confident and cocky when we were back at the Pillar of Phantoms. And we also look back on Audrey's sudden appearance. If she wasn't there to attack us and just there to say hey, then she must have been there for some reason, obviously. <sighs> and we deduce that that reason must be something very deep. Something like casting delusions upon an entire nation. When we put all these pieces of the puzzle together, we soon realized... Wait we could really do something very important about this. <sighs> Audrey clearly wasn't going to stop the delusions. So we went and spoke to the military. Yes, now. Audrey, I challenge you to a duel. <gasps> a duel in the land of tides? You're aware that this could lead to death for you, right, Aisha? Yes, but I am prepared to sacrifice myself to the people of Tides. They don't deserve to live in stupid delusions. So what do you say, Audrey? Would you take on the duel, or are you too scared to do it? Hmm. <laughs> Alright, I'm not scared of some stupid little fairy. I'll go through with the duel. The loser will die. I'm glad we're on the same page. Let's go. All right, now our only option is to cheer Aisha on and hope she wins. Don't worry, she's Aisha. She literally wins at everything. Well, she will win. <laughs> right? Right? She won't. Audrey is too powerful for her. R I mean, you couldn't even defeat her yourself directly, right? I mean, you had to turn the gem of Relix against her after all. Fire of Believix, Aura of Believix, Light of Believix, Essence of Believix, Wave of Believix, Voice of Believix, Heart of Believix. The portal is still working. Keep going. Duh, it's turning on us. No, we're not going back to a prison hellscape again. Uh, yeah. And we still beat her and the rest of the clan. Don't underestimate Aisha. She's much stronger than all of us. Exactly. She won't give up. Well then, let's go and watch the duel, shall we? Sure. Let's. Here we are, Aisha. Are you prepared to lose? You talk a lot, but don't do much. Don't worry. I've noticed it. It's kind of stupid, actually. Huh? Yeah. <sighs> Oh, please, you talk a lot too. And you're still so weak. Ugh. Exactly what I said. I won't give up and I won't disappoint my friends. Hmm. Oh, really? Yeah. Morphic shield. And yes, really. Neptune sting. Ugh. 
Alright, I'll give that one to you. Well, you're not exactly as weak as I thought you'd be. Hmm. Alright then. Embers of Darkness Ignite! Huh? Oh, ha, 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 ha. How do you like me now? Huh? Oh, you still don't get it. Well, let me make a demonstration for you. Everlasting as the moon! Ugh. Ow. How'd you get stronger? That's for me to know and for you to never find out. Alright. Yuff! Pathetic! Ugh. Wow, I truly would have been expecting more from a guardian fairy. Well then, I guess this is the end. It wasn't nice knowing you at all. <gasps> we have to help her! Musa, remember what the guard said. If we intervene, then it's game over. I guess this is it. No! I can send her a motivational message, right? I guess so. Alright. Yo. Mm -hmm. Huh? Yes. <gasps> she got up! Huh, I wonder if I can also... Yes. No, but this is cheating! You're intervening and helping her! That's what I said, Bloom, Musa! Well, there were no rules about power-ups. And Audrey used a power-up as well, so we're technically not cheating, just motivating her. Huh? What's happening? <sighs> What? Hey, I feel stronger now. Right, you're over, Audrey. I summon all of the powers within the ocean. I summon Neptune's trident that was lost eons ago. Give me your power! Oh no. Yuff! Yuff! No! Ugh, I can't get up! Goodbye, Audrey. It was not nice knowing you. Yuff! Yuff! No! Phew. Huff. We knew you could do it. That was amazing. <laughs> yeah. That was cheating. You helped her. Oh, boo hoo. Not even the military thinks so. Huh? The Book of Dreams. Congratulations on your victory and on earning your Jimix powers, Aisha. For all that you've done, we grant you a single wish. I wish for the Power Hunt Decree to be seized, and for the Land of Tides to have new rulers. Rulers that don't exploit them and take their powers away from them. What? Then your wish shall be granted. Oh, you wouldn't dare! No! Screw you all! Good choice, Aisha. Woo! Alright, I think we should get back to Althea. I'm quenched. Right, let's go!